Greetings fellow couponers and shoppers. This is Monday, July 2nd. And this is a Sprouts run. Wasn't really planning on going there, but I had a doctor's appointment and it wasn't I wasn't very far from there, so I thought, what the heck, I'll just stop in there. I did have some coupons that were getting ready to expire. Uh, one of them tomorrow and another one in a couple more days. Uh, the coupons I used were for the the silk dairy-free um, pretend yogurt. <laughs> uh, it's a yogurt alternative made with soy. Uh, they're 55 cent coupons. So two of them were going to be expiring tomorrow. And these were not on sale. They were $1.39 minus the 55 cent coupon. So made them a little cheaper. The Zivia. There are these energy drinks, zero calorie. I had uh, two one dollar coupons. One I just printed the other day was going to expire the 15th, but the other one I had printed a while back, and I think it was going to be expiring in a couple days. So these were on sale two for three dollars. I used the two one dollar coupons, which uh, made them what uh, three dollars, my uh, two dollars, uh, about a dollar. And then I bought us got uh, I believe a dollar cash back on two, so uh, two for three dollars. Yeah, so that makes those about free, doesn't it? Because uh, two one dollar coupons and a dollar cash back, so that's three dollars, and they were two for three dollars, so I made those free. And I picked up a can of garbanzo beans. These this is the sprouts. Uh, Variety and it was just it wasn't on sale. It was just 89 cents. No coupons there Picked up another one of these Justin's chocolate hazelnut butter blends. These were not on sale either These were this one was a dollar 29. I bought it has a how much is that cash back 50 cents cash back on that And I picked up these uh, hummus uh, were on sale the hope hummus. This is a kale pesto and this one is the jalapeno cilantro I bought one of these the other last week when I went to uh, Sprouts, and uh, it's pretty good. Uh, this is organic hummus. These are just a little, what are these, 8 ounce size. And they happen to be on sale this week, uh, two for five dollars. And also, I bought, it's got a 25 cent cash back. Now, I thought the cash back was a little more last week. I can't remember exactly how much it was. But anyway, it makes it a little bit cheaper. And then on to some fresh produce. They had uh, one of these red peppers on sale for, I believe, $1.25 a piece. Uh, these Washington uh, red cherries were on sale for $1.67 a pound. I picked up some of this. Uh, this is organic. I've never tried this particular Los Amato kale. I've never tried that before. It's organic kale, and that was, uh, I believe, 99 cents. The I picked up some sunflower seeds. This was from the bulk section. These were $1.99 a pound. This little bit right here, how much was this? Uh, I don't know. Uh, this little bit was 54 cents. <laughs> I guess I should have picked up a little bit more than that. And the Nature's Own Perfectly Crafted Bread. This was on sale, $2.49. Probably not the best price. Uh, and I bought it, still has an 85 cent cash back on all that. So all this little bit of groceries came after tax was like uh, about $23.73. I used uh, $3.10 in coupons. Which made after tax about twenty dollars. I mean, yeah, after tax about twenty dollars and sixty-three cents. And then I have uh, what about uh, uh, pending here? Two dollars and what eighty-five cents, and uh, I bought a rebate, so it's not too bad. Uh, this was uh, this is only my second trip to Sprouts, and you know a lot of their stuff is organic or vegan or vegetarian or whatever natural foods and some a lot of it is not cheap but if you scan the sale ads and this is only the second sale ad I've, I've been I've, I've <coughs> come across there are some, some pretty good deals it's not bad at all and just a little side note if you are a movie buff 
Barnes & Noble right now is running their semi-annual Criterion Collection sale, uh, which is, they, all their Criterion uh, Blu-rays and DVDs are half price, and these are, can you imagine paying $40 for a movie? But that's the normal price for Criterion movies. That's the list price, but they are 50% off, so that makes that $20. Still a lot of money for a movie. But anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching.